Sourcing used cars in the Midwest seems to have loosened up briefly. Find out what this very successful dealer has been doing differently in the last year and a half to feed his dealership's 200 a month appetite. Hi, this is Ted Roberts with Automotive Digest and I am here at the NIADA convention in Las Vegas and I am speaking with Michael DeAndrea of the Miracle Motor Mart in Columbus, Ohio. Michael, thank you very much for uh, being willing to talk to us. Glad to be here, Ted. Thank you. What are you doing sort of in the space of, of sourcing vehicles from outside your city, outside your region? Do you do it very often? And if so, what sort of vehicle transport do you use and what's your experience been? Ted, that's a great question. We, because we turn cars so quickly, our average turn is 23 days in stock. Because it takes time to get a car from out of state, mm -hmm. it slows the process of turn. And what we're trying to do now, and it's different than what we've done in the past, we, we would typically buy 20% to 25% out of state and mm -hmm. ship it in. In the last year and a half, it's been about 5% out of state to bring in. There's so much product available lately in the last year and a half locally that we don't feel like we need to ship it in. Mm -hmm. So because the lease returns have jumped up in numbers at auction houses, mm -hmm. so we're pretty satisfied with what's available local. We have two great auctions. We have Columbus Fair Auto Auction, which is a, a large independent auction, mm -hmm. and then there's a Mannheim in Columbus. So there's two excellent auctions, and we use them well.